Hello folks, we're Show Me Go Explore at it again with another amazing, amazing location. Right now we're looking at the back building that used to be the laundromat for the facility of Wentworth Military Academy. That's right, we're going to be looking at all the facilities of this academy school that was closed in 2017. And it was originally opened in 1880 and we're just going to do one building at a time today because there's so many neat things to look at and see. So like I said, right now I'm just showing you the back end. It's currently being used as the maintenance facility for the grounds of the school. But this started out as the laundromat facility. And I'm going to show you just kind of the ins and outs of this building right here. You can see kind of where there's just some leftover from it, some back door areas. It does say caution danger, but we have been allowed permission and access to go in. But look at this beautiful red brickwork here we have coming up on the side. Like I said, I'm just going to show you guys, you folks, all that I can get access to. Back that out right here in the driveway. But yeah, I mean, look at this. This is just one, one building of several out here on the grounds of the military academy. And the current groundskeeper, maintenance person that's occupying it now, that keeps it orderly and everything, he said his great-grandmother used to do the laundry here inside this facility when that was way back in its heyday. And so, yeah, we're just going to have a look around here. I'm going to show you guys this extensive, glorious, beautiful building out here on the grounds. You can see the steps. That's where we'll go down. But before we do that, I'm just going to keep showing you the other side real quick. Because this building, everything's a lot bigger on the inside. And you can see kind of down right there where we're going. We're going to wrap around and see all of that. But look, it's just sitting here now, currently without, without anyone except for, like I said, we have just for the maintenance folk, the groundskeeper, keeping it together, making sure the trespassers stay out of it. I'll show you this door down here. I mean, look at this. Right down here. But yeah. So we turn back around and we're going to show you the inside of this location. And there are steps going down, so I'm going to carefully descend down into the doorway here. And go down. Crunchy leaves for fall. All right. Thank you. My door opener. All right. And we go. And we are in the main entryway here, right inside of, like I said, what is now the maintenance, the maintenance keep. But this was originally the laundromat. Oh, let me show you this. This is really neat. I have to showcase this right here. I'll try to get that glare off of it. And here we are. Wentworth Military Academy. Lexington, Missouri. And see right there is the establishment year and their their motto. It's in Latin. Pull back out. And yeah, we're just gonna go room by room in this place and show you guys everything in here. Now since it is currently an office use building, there are desks and office things kept in here. But you can see. Just show you guys. You can see the windows kind of letting us know we're underground now. Partially there. But yeah, it's just an office place right now being kept. Like I say, there is currently a groundskeeper that works in here. It keeps everything orderly. We'll kind of walk back into here. But yeah, this building has been shut down since 2017. So right now, according to the date on this video, that would be about a year ago. But just let you see everything inside. Just a little closet room right here. All right, we're going to turn around. And I'll show you folks this other little office room back in here. Just kind of pan up and show you. But yeah, what a neat place. Like I said, a little desk. Like I said, it's just being used for to maintain the business and the operations of the day-to-day -day keepings of the grounds around here. And here, yeah, we have a doorway we're going to go in right now. I'll show you up. But yeah, I just want to show you kind of the state of this building right now inside. 
Yeah. And then we'll turn around. And I can show you the other end. Again, just more supplies, maintenance supplies, cleaning supplies, all kinds of things. Try to keep it intact. All right. And we'll walk back out the way we came. That's where it closes off. And then we'll go to the right side. But yeah, see, that's the doors that we came in right there. And we'll just keep going right in here. And here we have just some storage area. Be careful stepping. All right. Yeah. Just more storage room. Lots of storage room. Gotta have storage for all the supplies in here. Keep it going. But yeah. Isn't this neat? All right. There's a lot more to show you where that's coming on. So I'm going to turn back around and go out down the hallway here. And like I said, this used to be the main laundry facility when the school was in operation. So we'll go have a look real quick. Again, we have another little room here. Again, this is currently for the maintenance. But yeah, look at this. this spacious, spacious room right here. And you can see there used to be, looks like a little, little kind of kitchenette set up right now. Some fridge and things, oven, microwave. People can work and eat. I'm going to show you two real quick. This really, really neat map on the wall here. I'm going to show you just exactly the caliber of place we're dealing with here. I'll back that out just a little bit. But yep, Wentworth Military Academy. Try to zoom in a little bit. You can see all these areas. Track field, field house. And the students, this is one of those schools where the students actually lived here. So that's why they needed the laundry facility. Because they would have to wash their clothes and uniforms and bed sheets and everything. Because they couldn't do it at home. They were here for the school year. And this is just a a little bathroom area right there. As simple as that. All right. I bet it was loud in here when all those machines were going, though. I can imagine all those washers and dryers trying to clean everybody's, everybody's uniforms and everybody's just clothing for school. All right. And then here we have a nice long hallway. And we're going to venture down that. Take my time, walking along. I'm going to go left first. Just kind of show you folks what's down in here. And we're going to go down on this side and along the way. Yeah, check this out. Oh. Now, those are the doors from the outside that I zoomed in on. Those are those doors for access right there. I'm not going to open them because they are boarded up, but I just want to show you, give you a frame of reference. But yeah. Here we are at another part of the facility. Just right here. I mean, look at this place. And it's just, it's still standing. That's the amazing thing is that it's still all here. All of this. We do have some nice natural light coming in those big windows right there. But yeah. Well, the paint, like I said, now it's just kind of more for storage and things. But yes, this used to be the laundry area doors all kinds of stuff I can only imagine how much effort it takes to keep a keep a place like this orderly and clean and maintained and yeah a lot of work it is unfortunate the school is closed now because there is nobody in it so yeah let's see you there all right we're just going to walk down here, the other side of the hall now. Here's where utilities and things were. Again, nice big bright windows let in that natural light. We have some locker storage over here. Still intact. It's pretty neat. Coming around. Just film right here. Yeah floor and nothing's left in here all the all the appliances and things have since been sold and taken out in their original original days of use and yeah we have another another little room in here 
currently. Oh wow, look up here. Ceiling. Like I said. I can only imagine how many people it took to wash everything before the before the students started doing it when they employed people to do the laundry for them. Alright. Alright, there's steps here, so I'm just gonna carefully, carefully ascend down here. Aha, switch. But yeah, and here we go. This is just from the top of one of the stair areas. So I will keep going down further. I want to get this this shot right here. We're entering what is um, was the workshop area for the students. And so let me show you. Right here, we have this gorgeous chandelier. And the groundskeeper told us that every spring they would have a, a military ball. And this was the centerpiece they would hang up in the on the ceiling for the gym stage. That's really pretty. I like that. I can only imagine how many students were dancing underneath it, maybe drinking some punch, you know. <laughs> Just having a good time, letting loose as much as you can for a military school. But yeah, here we this is just the workshop area now. Or was the workshop area. And this is a sign for their homecoming. Their mascot was the dragons, known as the red dragons. I did read up on that. And this is from one of their last homecomings that they had. Isn't that neat? We're just going to show you. I mean, look at this place. These original bricks in here. Just the structure. How cool. How amazing. Lots of work tables, workbench areas. I'll come around back in here. This was the homecoming queen's chair, we were told. Okay, I'm going to carefully turn around so you all can see that. But yeah, she would sit up here, claim her throne and her crown, as it were, for homecoming queen. I wonder how many, how many kids sat in that over the years. It's so neat that they still have that here, I think. Just little things like that. And this, let's see if I can get the focus, was a parade float football that the kids made and put together. And you can see the white lines around the, the football and everything, and how they made it. Yeah. Keep going up here. There's another little stairwell inside the workshop area. And we'll go in here too. Careful, careful, and I will find a light. Aha. So yes. I mean this is what's this is what's left of the laundromat maintenance area. See there used to be a fire extinguisher there. Oh yeah, just like I said, it's so neat that this is here and that we were allowed to come inside and, and see this part. So yeah, I'm just gonna turn around. But yeah, think of all the kids that were in here building and making things, woodworking, sanding hammering, gluing, I mean everything you could think of to do in a workshop area. And it was all right here. Now it's just quiet except for my footsteps on a few leaves. Yeah, some cubby areas here. Come over and have a look. Yeah, like I said, now it's maintenance notes. But yeah, how neat. Look at that. Right in here. Pegboard. How cool. How neat. Yeah. Big old workbench right here. These are neat. Industrial shop. It's always a fun class. Here we go. This is cool right here. Look at this. Work orders. Right there. For people. I want to zoom in on this this board right here because it actually says the school name right there. Wentworth Military Academy. So yeah. But not being used now, like I said, except for maintenance and office. So let's turn out the light. Come back down these steps. Slowly. 
just have a look from that stairway just to kind of get a reference again. Yeah. All the way up. And yeah, you can look at the ceiling, isn't that neat? You can see where they've poured like the concrete and stuff up there. I think that's so cool. You can see all that inner workings and things. So all right folks, this was like I said the maintenance building now, but what used to be the laundry facility. And we're going to cut the video off right here. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and like us on Facebook. Find us on Instagram and Twitter. And we will see you folks very soon again.